morning, good morning. Today is my appointment with Antioxidantti Clinica. There's a doctor called Pyry Suonsivu. And uh, let's see what he says about my my diet and all of these. I've now I've res rescheduled this time once because it overlapped with my Swedish trips and I had marked it in my calendar to be four o'clock yesterday but nope it was eight o'clock this morning so now I'm driving up there to see what they have to say um, let's see they have this Yoku yeah frozen some weird embryo <laughs> I don't know what it was but some weird thing that you can get from a Luantai store or from a health store not even a pharmacy not to say anything good about pharmacies but Let's see if this is what he's gonna order because if that's the only thing that uh, is gonna be the remedy, then I'm a bit miffed because I could have walked in life or one of these stores and just get it for myself. But yeah, I thought it was yesterday, and I drove to this antioxidant clinica. And I drove there in the evening traffic. It took me about an hour to, or not an hour, 45 minutes to get there, and then. Why am I soft in the middle of the rest of my life is so hard. I need a photo opportunity. I want a shot of redemption. Don't want to end up a cartoon. Had a refreshing visit to the doctors or this antioxidanti clinica. I think it's to an extent it's playing on the fears of people. Uh, I and mean it's interesting. But the positive thing was that there was a discussion, there was a dialogue that we could have with the doctor and he wasn't taken back by my quite extravagant vitamin D usage. He was even saying that take more, that his maximum level would be a hundred thousand international units a day for a certain period uh, with obviously testing because over, cons over consumption of vitamin D may lead in toxicity but he was of the opinion that yeah this is it is reversible MS disease is I don't know but let's see they're gonna send me an Oh man, I've got a parking ticket. I just noticed it on... So it's 300 euros for the doctor and it's 60 euros for the parking. An expensive visit to the doctors. Plus then the labs, they'll be so unpleasantly expensive but yeah there's some weird neurolipidi yuama that they they are giving me or prescribing to me which is 
yeah, I don't know how it's gonna go. And apparently, it is made out of pig brain. And yeah, I need to look at the tuote seloste, the ingredients of it more carefully when I get it. I'll go get my parking ticket. Right, yeah. No, it's increased. It's 80 euros. Oh, yeah. So, I went yesterday to the Kivenine doctor and they. Uh, I want to show you the list of products that he gave me. Uh, here it's, or maybe it's better to look. So basically, there's a drink that you prepare from uh, uh, different. Uh, no, it's not this one. It's this is the drink. So he printed three pages worth of stuff to me. Uh, that I should consume and the nasty thing is that these cost about 200 euros but the good thing was he was very positive yeah let's aim for you running in you know, uh, in a short while but I'll show the most expensive stuff that they had so these are in the refrigerator it's called green plus uh, it's Vehnan Oras Spirulina uh, Shirolla Vihreä Tee Juomatiiviste Jääpalat uh, has a very funky smell to it uh, and, uh, but this, this one I think was the most expensive one of them all it cost like 98 bucks or euros it is called Vahva Neurolipidi and if I right remember, it was an extract from pig brains. I'll see if I can. I'll see if I can find the English terms for them. But basically, it is. Yeah, it's extra extracted from pigs' brains, and uh, it's supposed to make your nervous system and all that function better. In addition to that. There was active way that you mix into this drink with those icy products. Then there's L carotene. I don't know how to pronounce that in English. Then uh, the uh, thanks to Pape, it's vitamin D. Uh, he said that twenty thousand. International units would be just fine, uh, but they're going to take labs next Thursday to see. B12, this I need to check, this I got from Pate, uh, this I need to check whether this B12, he had other B products, so I'm just going to check whether this will be alright. And then there's Energy Way. Uh, and uh, finally, there is this <laughs> neural landing forte, which is for when I travel instead of uh, in because I can't take those uh, frozen products overseas. So today I'm gonna go and get one of these Annostelia, you know, where you separate your different medicines into doses and uh, yeah so I can I know what I've taken and all that because that's way too much it just goes out of my head that's what I'm supposed to take I can call you Betty Betty when you call me you can call me out it's the weekend a man walks down the street he says why am I 
eyes short of attention Got a short for the airport span of attention and warm my nights an hour or so with Terry. I'm taking Terry to Stockholm for the first time. Um, and it's our wedding day. So it's kind of. Uh, I've been now consuming this neurolipidy, some extract from pigs' brains. Mm, it doesn't taste that marvelous, but you know, it's just half a liter of it's whey protein activated whey protein uh, then it's some um, yeah doesn't taste that great then um, but i'll do it at least for uh, at least for some time i've been cycling now for the weekend and uh, i noticed that my yeah, if I if I do exercise properly, then I'm I feel quite all right. I now now I did the first one that lasted over an hour. Uh, and and I could do it. And I was even contemplating should I make it longer. But today, when I did it, I only did about 40 minutes. And I clearly chose, to, I drove, drove home. What else? Got my dosetti. It's this thing where you put your medicines. I'll maybe show it sometime. I bet it brings to mind uh, el elderly people. Holding, holding your medicine and, and this that I remember to take everything but yeah I'm being a whole lot worse and I'm thankful that I'm feeling as good as I am Jesus is king who will be my role model now that my role model is gone, gone, he ducked back down the alley with some roly-poly little bat-faced girl. 